Hey guys, really quickly, I have a thrift haul for y'all, so let's go ahead and jump in. All of this is pretty much kids' toys. There's two items that aren't. If you watched my book hauls, that came from the same store. So, the lady had totes for sale. They didn't have the lids, which is fine. I picked up a big clear one, which is in front of me, and then this big green one for 50 cents a piece. Um, they're just good to have around for storage and things like that. So, I picked it up. I picked up a bowl with a straw for 25 cents. We can always use more bowls around here, especially with the kids. They go through tons of stuff. I picked up this, like, terry cloth blanket. If you see that, look how pretty this is. And I picked that up for Mason because I'm planning on doing something. I was planning on just doing a room for Cooper and a room for Mason on their own, but I believe what we're going to do is a room for them together. So that's what I'm planning on working on. So I picked that up for that. And then the last bag is kids toys. So the kids toys, it was a Walmart garbage bag full for $10. So I was able to get everything in there for $10. So I don't know how much it all breaks down to. I got this little elephant rattle for Mason. Also picked him up this little love you book with a little, I think that's a hedgehog or a porcupine. I'm not sure which one, but just look how cute. It's a cloth book so I can wash it. I picked up this Spider-Man car. I'm actually going to resell him. It did have a three stuck dollar sticker on it, but that was part of the bag deal. So I was not charged the three dollars. It was just charged ten dollars altogether. Picked up another little rattle for Mason. A little car for Mason and it had a dollar sticker on it. It's a ladybug and makes noise. Let's see. Picked up a little airplane green toys. I've seen this at Target before for like 10 bucks. Another little Mason rattle. A little school bus car for the kids to play with. Thought Mason would like that. It had a 50 cent sticker. Um, but Mason really likes Cooper's cars to roll on the floor. That's why I got that airplane and this little car. And I think these are the last two like kids, like little Mason toys. I picked him up this little toy and it spins. Nick's mom has a toy in her house that spins like this on a walker and he loves it. I ordered one similar from Timu that's supposed to be coming in in like two weeks, but I saw this so I picked it up. I'll just have to wipe it down with some Clorox wipes. And then I saw this and thought it was really cute. <laughs> you hug it and it just makes noises. And I'm not sure if it can go into different modes. Let's see. No, I don't believe it goes into different modes. I think it's just, so it just has one mode, but it's still really, really cute. So I'm gonna turn that off before it kind of creeps me out because it has kind of a creepy laugh. <laughs> and then the next thing is all three of the same thing, just different characters. So let me show you, I got these for resale, but if I'm probably gonna, I might keep one for my kids. I'm not sure yet, so don't quote me on that. But they're these for real dogs and animals that you walk. And they're supposed to make noise, but I don't see that these do make any noise. I don't, maybe they don't. I'm not sure. If they don't, it's okay. I'll still be able to resell them. And basically it has this little leash and you hook it on here if I can figure it out. Yep, yeah, like there. And you're able to walk it across the floor. So, picked up this one and they had a 250 sticker on it. And these go for like 20 to 30 dollars because I bought one for Cooper two years ago for Christmas brand new at Walmart. I'm not, I think this one's a kitty cat, I think. 
$2.50 as well. I'm sure this came from the same family because they were all next to each other. Let's try and stick this one in as well and I'll show you. Yep. And you just walk the kitty across the floor because it has the little wheel on the bottom. And then the last one is another little puppy dog. It kind of reminded me of Remy. So we might actually keep this one. Um, just because it reminds me of Remy. The handle is actually broken on this one. I didn't even notice, but it's okay. Maybe it's not. I can't tell. Nope, actually it's not. It just is made a little bit differently than the other one. It doesn't have the big bulky piece. I probably will keep this one. I'm not sure. It, reminds me. it looks just like Remy to me. So that is all for this little thrift haul and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.